Alright. We're at London. Apparently London has multiple viewpoints. <clears throat> I beg patience, old. Stone. Have this rack cleaned up in no time. Keep it steady. Huh? <laughs> Neon yeah, love. Hey, bear our master, Ami. You'll be on your way shortly, huh? Something up a shepherd, aren't you? <laughs> I can feel that way, aye. Can I help you with something? Who governs this borough? I would like to speak with him, if I can. Ah, the governor Trigger. Hmm. Good and fair day and come to London four year back. Trigger? Aye, most hours of the day you can find him at the old villa. <laughs> dealing with old manor and Avery. Stow! Uh oh. <laughs> Avgos wants his cut of the summer harvest. Shit, Carl. <laughs> huh? What's the hold up? <laughs> I was like, fuck talking. you. <clears throat> Gentlemen, the farmers of Mercia have paid their burden already. If Avgos wants more, he can petition for it. <clears throat> petition for it? Well, you can tell that old mud merchant. <laughs> And if he wants his apple, he can bob for it. Belongs to Master Ame, sir. Bob for it! That is filthy. Bob for it! I was gonna fuck this guy up. Oh! Never mind. <laughs> this guy's a cool guy. <laughs> He's like, fuck you, shitheads. Fucking morons. Is this kind of noise coming to London? Now nah, we've a quiet day once. Spun attack. I try not to kill anyone, eh? Damn, wrecked them. Wrecked his nuts. Stomped them. <laughs> that was cool. He just fucked the guy up. God in heaven, <laughs> you fight like the devil stolen your bread. You give some hard knocks yourself. Road. You're a good lad and prick the names of those that pay their food tax, will you? Right then. You've some dealings with Governor Trigger, was that it? I will have dealings with any who can deliver fair friendship with my Raven clan. If that is you, then all the better. Ah, mm -hmm. no. Trigger's your fellow. I'm the Shire Reeve of London's Western. Oh, the Sheriff. I keep things ordered and fair. Shire oh, I didn't Reeve know is that. A name that rides easy on the tongue. Yeah, I didn't know that Shire Reeve was eventually abbreviated into Sheriff. I had no idea. Oh, that sounds cool. The Shire Reeve, or Sheriff. Okay. I'm learning stuff playing this game. Um, Kiki, uh, 4444, reset for five months. I said, love the stream. What's the next major release you're looking forward to? Um, well, major releases, I missed a few. There's so many games that have come out in the last, like, two months. I missed Immortals Phoenix Rising, and I'm going to be playing that one next. Okay, I want to play Sackboy, but I don't want to spend 60 bucks for it. I get a feeling it's going to be cheaper soon. Like, maybe right after Christmas, those games will go on sale. So I want to play it, but I'm not dumping 60 on that. If it goes down to, like, like 30 or 40, maybe I'll get it. Um, I'm curious about Hades, because it's another game that everyone said was, like, a Game of the Year contender for 2020. I didn't play it. I know a few people who didn't said that it was a really good game. Uh, outside of that... The first major release, I think, of 2021 is Hitman 3. There's another one. There's two major ones coming out in, J in January that I'm interested in. I can't remember the other one. I definitely remember Hitman. I don't remember what the next one is. I can't remember. Yeah. Does anyone remember what the other one is? Shit. An anonymous gifter gifted a tier 3 sub to Mirai Masaki. Congratulations, Mirai Masaki. And thank you, whoever gifted the tier 3 sub. That helps a lot. Thank you for that, whoever that was. <clears throat> okay, let's continue. My title, <clears throat> sorry. Stow's my name. Stow of Lunden. Oh my god, you can... You, you, oh, you're barely fighting. Stupid choice. It is good to meet you, Reevestow. Lunden sits on sturdy shoulders. Uh, to be fair, I'm not the only Reeve. There are two of us now, and the governor to boot. We do our best in these times, wild as they are. No, oh, you're barely man. Oh. Sounds like a man worth <laughs> knowing. Right then. Station field, flock shepherded, and off to Trigger we go. And what can I call you? 
Humbler of thugs, Dane Hammer. <laughs> I am Aver of the Raven Clan. We have a settlement to the north, just off the River Neen. Well, I owe you a great debt, Eivor. You're a worthy ally. I guess we'll do the viewpoints so, after we go for a tour London, with him. A city built by giants. So they say. She's an old place, as early as they come. But there's a mystery here I quite adore. I was raised here, in fact. I learned the scriptures of Christ's apostles in Lundinwich. I was Saxon Burra, just past the Western Wars. You're not a priest, are you? <laughs> no. No, no, I was raised by them. And for a penniless bastard, I turned out pretty well. A penniless bastard, and now London's fearless reap. <laughs> well, it's Trigger who saw something in me. He judges not the circumstance of my birth. Ugh. His two hands, left and right, are me and a Dane-born soldier, Erke. Erke is an orphan of the last Viking horde to put down in London for a season. Two or three years back now, it must have been. Wait. Something's wrong. Uh -oh. Iron on the air. This blood is fresh. These were good men. What's happened here? Someone attacked the governor? Oh, shit. That's not good. An anonymous gifter now gifted a tier 3 sub to Daki Smurf. Congratulations, Daki Smurf, on the tier 3 sub. Thank you again to whoever this is. Nist Star Rune Cheers said, we're games of the front runners for the marathon. I don't know. I haven't no, looked no. yet. I told you guys already. No, no, I have to no. look into it probably tomorrow night. <clears throat> I haven't had a chance. Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. You think that they fucking went a little overkill on him? What the fuck? This wasn't a murder. This was a statement. No need for outsider stone. It's a private matter. Fucking no shit. to be leery. Eivor had my back in a brawl at Cripplegate. More thugs from the garrison. Mm. You must be a real broker to hold your own against those shit hugs. <laughs> it's time to fatter those men, though. It can't go on like... like this. Yeah, holy fuck. That was the governor trigger? Jesus. If this one had a head, you'd be calling him trigger, yes? You got no. caught above. The man is dead. Some respect, please. We'll get along well, you and me. <laughs> You must be Erke, London's second reeve. Erke Botelson, yes I am. Are you telling me this gut bucket called me second reeve? <laughs> yes, in Eastborough. And the man I trust with my life. Stowe's never been a good judge of character. <laughs> Erke, this is Eivor. He came to meet with Trigger. To seal the bonds of friendship with his clan. He would have welcomed you heartily. He was a trusting man. And I got him here. Jeez. You found anything? I just arrived. The killers left a ladder on the body there. I'll have a look around. The trigger had men with him at all times. It's fucking crazy. How could the killers get through? I must have been known to him. Well enough to get close without suspicion. Good and holy Christ, that can be most anyone. He governed this bird. Oh, you know, now that the governor's dead, he's not gonna need this loot anymore. Just fucking take it. Learned Uba? Uber, my commander, my friend. I hope you're in high spirits in the warm weather. London never gets cold as Norway. Oh, that was stupid. That was not doing anything. I didn't think. He didn't want you to. It was his secret to keep. What's this? What do I do? A barber surgeon's tools. Sharp and precise for easy butchery. Must have been what was used to free Trigger's head from his leg. Ah. Interesting. New Star Room, my answer is I haven't looked into anything yet. I'm probably going to do it tomorrow night. Three sets of footprints leave. Two average and one massive. Hmm. Weird. Two average, one massive. There's a giant with them, apparently. What the heck? have a fucking giant. Well, oh, can't open this right now. This letter. Someone wanted us to see it. From Rome, when the order of heretics who worshipped the relics of a time before Christ. Erke, this was the letter he told us about. He said it contained fearful news about London. Hmm. It warns of three such heathens who have infiltrated London. His killers, I expect. Hmm. Three heathen 
Russians to infiltrated London. Okay. Anything else? Maybe outside? see anything else. So maybe outside is a trail. Hmm. Don't really see anything else. There's something else. There's one more thing I missed, but what is it? of evidence somewhere. What the hell am I missing? Uh, I saw this. No, I do not celebrate Columbus Day, Baldy. I saw that. I don't know what else I'm missing. Excuse me. The fuck? Oh my god! What the hell? There's a body hanging up there? Whoa! Okay. I was not expecting to find that up there. What the hell? Who the hell is hanging? Do not end me this man's death. Hang on. There's something in his hand. This was not Trigger's seal? No. It looks Roman in origin. It must have been on a ladder he opened. It must have been significant mm. to this guard for him to grasp it even in death. Perhaps it's what got him killed. I think I have a clear idea of what happened here. Trigger was shot where he sat. Probably as he read the letter. Damn. One of his guards grabbed the seal. Tried to escape. He didn't do it. A second killer found him first. He met his end at the noose, lifted by the bigger man. A third attack took his eyes, then came for Trigger's head. Symbolic, maybe. Headless leader, eyeless guards. Mm. The killers were without fear. This killer was a message. Their footprints leave together, three sets heading back to the courtyard. The letter mentions three heretics, named only by Manikas. The leech, the arrow, the compass. Signed by hmm. someone calling himself a poor fellow soldier of Christ. Poor fellow soldier. Odd name. Three names, three killers, as you said. Baldersack. It could be <laughs> anyone in London. Baldersack. Only the people in this room. I oh, should. Jasper, it's Baldersack. Can wise, you believe it? Until we know more. <laughs> <clears throat> Arrow is described as a pugnacious Dane invader. That describes too many in London. The leech hails from Vesex. London is home to many of them as well. And the compass, a Frankish captain. Less common, but no face comes to mind. What is this symbol here? I recognize that from the Mithraic temple. I passed it on the way here. What's a Mithraic temple? Mithraic temple. Is that a church? A church? Heavens, no. Mithras was a pagan idea. A so-called god beloved by the ancient soldiers that built this city. Hmm. Our city is overrun with cowards. We may be next to fall if we don't resolve this sick fermentation of hate. I've told you, this city answers to blood and power. We should serve as such. I can't leave him like this. He's... I need to... We'll get the church to see to it, though. No. No, it should be me. I must ready him for judgment. I understand. Only get some air from time to time. It reeks in here. What you doing, buddy? Shall we, Broga? Damn. So there's three people who are heretics who do really detest everything about this area, and they come and just kill the governor like that. Oh, well, Bloody... Disgusting murder, huh? Yuck. Alright. 
So they want me to go to the temple, which is right next door, by the way. I what I should do before I do the temple is I should do the viewpoints in this in this area. Yeah, let me do the let me do the viewpoints in town first. There's one there. There's one over there. Unlock those. Maybe even try to grab some of these items if I can. Okay. Jasper Kitty, what are you doing, buddy? Huh? Were you were you were you sleeping and then you got lonely? You wanted to come in here and be part of the action. Is that what it is? Jasper wanted to be part of the action tonight. No, what he wanted was attention. He wanted some rubs. <clears throat> and he probably wants me to put the controller down and stop streaming. But Stowe seems a good man. I will trust his word. Sonos 1982 did a 300 bit share with the Jasper emo. He did the Jasper emo. He did the emo to you, buddy. Yeah. Everyone likes you, Jasper. Everyone likes the kitty. Cute kitty. Everyone enjoys you and your antics. Especially when you jump in front of my TV and chew the wires and cause problems. <laughs> Are you not going to do any of that tonight, right? You promised me. You said those days were done. You said you were a reformed kitty. And you were not going to do those awful things anymore, right, buddy? That's what he told me last night. I asked him, I said, Jasper, are you ever going to do that again? He said, meow, meow, meow. So I know that he's, that he's telling me that he's not going to do that ever again. He wants to be a good kitty so he can stay in the office. That's what he told me. Now, Jasper, remember your promise, okay? Remember the promise you gave me. Be a good kitty. Go in the, there you go. Go in the pile of vests. Go in there. I know you like the pile of vests. Well, I climb up this statue's ass. Go in the pile of vests. There you go. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Sonos, for the 300 bit cheer. I appreciate that. Listen to myself? What do you mean? Listen to myself. <clears throat> Why am I talking like that? Because I like to talk nicely to Jasper. Jasper, do not do that. I see you looking up there. Don't do it. Come on, buddy. We just had this talk. <laughs> okay. Alright, so. There's a key down here? What's this? Why does it say there's a key here? There's nothing here. It's an empty fucking stool. Business notice you come to the main of Max Maximilian of Londin Londinium. It's his premier collection of ancient treasures. Oh, to return by the morrow. So we can't get in here yet unless we find the key. Right? <clears throat> okay. Um, I should also do the other viewpoint over here. Just have them both, just in case I need them both. And then I'll decide if I want to try to get these treasures or if I just want to continue with the story. Let's see here. So someone in the stream chat, I didn't catch the name, they said the reason that Jasper's probably acting up sometimes in the office is because there's a problem. Well, I know what the problem is. There's different personality types for cats, okay? Some cats absolutely want no human interaction whatsoever. They just want to be left alone. If you try to bother them, they'll claw your ass, okay? Those are considered red types of personalities, okay? Then there's... Oh, fuck. Then there's the blue... I think blue... There's red, blue, and green. I, I always get red, uh, blue, and green confused. But one of them is the kind of cat... <clears throat> that every once in a while appreciates pets or whatever, but for the in general, that cat is an independent cat and can usually survive and be by itself. It doesn't necessarily need tons of human interaction. My parents have a cat like that, where the cat will every once in a while come by for a pet and some food, but then just wants to be left alone the rest of the day. Okay? So that's considered, I think that's blue, and then Jasper would be considered green. Now what green is, is a cat that absolutely wants constant attention, 
wants to be a part of the action no matter what it is always wants to be in the middle of everything going on um it doesn't matter if it's something realistic for a cat or not that cat you're cooking cat wants to be in the middle of it you're, you're sitting on the couch cat wants to be with you you're gonna go oh you're gonna play a video game cat has to be in the office in front of the tv you see that's the kind of cat jasper is um and, you know, it's very attention-seeking. And the thing is, we give him tons of attention. When I'm not streaming, I give him attention. My wife gives him tons of attention. And it's not that he doesn't have anything to do. Oh, my God. He has plenty of things. He has a cat tree he can climb. He's got tons of toys around the house. He's got nice places he can hide and do that instinct where they like to go into, like, cave-like areas and hide. He can sleep in multiple areas. He's got all these things he can be doing. But he wants attention. He wants attention from the humans. Oh, that's not how we're supposed to do it. Quick. So if I can get inside, I believe there's a staircase down. I, don't, I wonder how you get inside here. So anyway, um, you know, that's the thing. That's the kind of cat Jasper is. It's not that we don't give him attention and we don't give him toys or anything. He just wants our attention no matter what. He wants our attention. He's never going to be the kind of cat that says, Oh, I'm independent. I'll just leave me alone. I'll be happy. No, he, he wants to be up in everything. Huh. How do I get in here? The door is barred from the other side. Excuse me. And there doesn't appear to be any way to unbar it because there's not a single hole in this building. It's not like you can get a vantage point and shoot it with an arrow. Uh, it just looks to me like it's going to be barred for good. And there's a way you have to get to it from another side, right? And that's how you unbar it. <laughs> There's definitely a treasure in there. But yeah, there's no way to do it from here. It must be from underground, which means there's likely, at some point, there's got to be a way to get inside of here. And maybe this leads underground or something. I'm not 100% sure, of course, but I'm hypothesizing. But yeah, it doesn't seem like there's another way to do it. Okay. All right. Well, the mission's over here. That's the temple we're supposed to go to. Yeah, find the entrance to the temple. What's this? This is probably one of those world events. Maybe we should see if we can do that world event quickly. And other resources. If I can grab some other resources. Jethro's main, thanks for the underhanded stab at me. And, and basically, it's like a, it's an underhanded insult. I appreciate that. I love it when my streamers, or my, my excuse me, my stream viewers uh, insult me at night. It's very nice. Polish Frog, yes, the, ja the, the, uh, the shelter did tell us Jasper's personality. They said that he seems like a, an outgoing cat. The one that wants to be, you know, lots of human involvement and the like. They, they basically knew he wasn't red because he wasn't hostile to any humans. He liked to get attention. He liked to be pet, etc. So they knew he wasn't a red cat. They knew that he was either blue or green. And they told us that they felt he was probably going to be an outgoing cat. But it wasn't safe to say because, you know, he had, he had not really, like, warmed up to anyone at the shelter so much. Shadow King 236 resell for 35 months. He says 35 months going strong. Love you, Phil. Keep up the good work. Thank you very much to Shadow King for almost three years of support. Almost the anniversary there. Okay. See, so there's some treasure here. Can I get the treasure? Because I definitely need the treasure. I need these resources in order to uh, upgrade my camp multiple things I need to upgrade, so any treasure I can get would be good. Of course, take a look. There's a million enemies here, and I think they may be pretty high level. They will attack on sight. Stupid snake. Find the key. I don't have the key. Son of a bitch. Let's see how high level these guys are. Don't 
Well, this sucks. Luckily, they're all the world's worst shot. Not a single one has hit me until now. They're really bad at what they're doing. to fight them because they fall. <laughs> yeah, look. They trip and fall. Oh my god. What the fuck? Glitchy physics. They're like, they can't figure out how to get over here. When they do, I just fuck them up. Yeah, look, they're confused. They can't figure it out. This is weird. Damn, her arm ripped off and rolled. That was gross. Oh, there's way less of them now. Compass orders. We need to hide these gifts or triggers men somewhere. I see. There's stuff down here. Yup, there's shit down here. Look at that. What the fuck? A cougar in here. Holy shit. Or mountain lion or some shit. Oh, that's the first one I've seen of that in the game. Nickel ingot. Wow, dead body. See the fucking thing and eating people. Damn. There's more loot around the corner. I think what I need to do is find the key on someone here to open that door. I think so. Line. The key? That's somewhere completely different. <laughs> Jasper is now laying down behind my whole entertainment center. I'm okay with that as long as he doesn't chew the wires and he's not. He's just laying there nicely. So, go right ahead, buddy. It's that same area. Okay. So, we're not done here yet. Keep looting. There's definitely something over there. I wonder if there's a way to blow a wall up or something to get over there, or if I just have to climb up and drop down in a different area. This is the house you need the key for, right? Yeah, this is the house you need the key for, but I don't know who has the key. I killed everyone in the fort and no one had it. So, obviously that wasn't it. Ah, go out oh, I didn't know there was going to be fire. Shit. I had no idea there would be fire like that.
No, I think I've done everything. I think that's all that was here. Was that little bit of loot? I think that's all that was here. I don't see anything else, really. All right. Oh, well. Sometimes you get some good stuff. Sometimes you get nothing, right? What do I like better, cheesesteaks or chicken cheesesteaks? I like them both. Uh, they taste very different, for sure. Um, but I think they're both quite good. Well, I guess I can't do this yet. I don't have the key. Yeah, I don't have the key, so I can't do this world event until I find the key. I don't know where the hell the key is. So. The game is saying there's some armor over here. Probably another locked house. Uh, I get the feeling all these areas are going to be freaking locked. Under me? But there... Huh? <laughs> In this house? Under us? There's a big thing underneath the ground here. Yeah. Likely it's a restricted area and you have to follow a tunnel or something under there to get to it. Alright, let's just go to this temple at this point. I'm getting so distracted by all the items, I'm not doing the stuff I'm supposed to do for the story. Right? <clears throat> okay. You know, I'm going to say something. I don't know if you guys realize this. Regulars in here, they come in here and they say the same stupid tired jokes every night about Derek, about the tips go, about this. And that. You guys notice, I don't respond to that because it's stupid. You're, you're doing dumb memes no one cares about. It's very immature when you do that. I, I prefer if someone would like talk to me about topics or ask me questions about the game or how I'm doing or something like that. Not let's meme about another stream viewer. You know, like, why do you think I'm not talking to you? You have to be like Team Big Nuts. Uh, comes in here every night and does it. Equilibrium comes in here every night and does it. And they wonder why I don't talk to them. Because I don't want to sit here memeing about nonsense all night. That's all you do. You don't talk about the games. You don't pay attention to that. You just fucking make up shit. Dumb shit. Like, so why do you think I'm not engaging you? Why is the stream seeming boring? Because all you're doing is acting like an idiot. I should be right? Stop acting like a fucking idiot. Maybe we'll have some fun. It's very frustrating when you got idiots who just want to fucking meme all night. Oh, talk about Derek, 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 Derek. Shut the fuck up, dude. Derek's not here. <laughs> We're not fucking five years old, dude. Oh my god, these people. That's why I like the spear. Anyway, what I was saying is that's why I like the spear because you can like cr cripple the shields and shit. I like that. Yeah, see, there's a bunch of shit underground here. Oh my god! <laughs> that was awesome. Where 
I'm on fire. Cool. See, he broke his shield. I love that about the spear. You snap the shield easily, too. Good night. Remember, I got to upgrade the more arrows hit. The more damage they do, so if I combo those arrows, two, three arrows is insane damage. And factor, what do we have for dinner? Uh, I already answered. I'm trying to remember. Oh, we had chi uh, ch chicken tenders and uh, French fries in the oven. Nothing special. It was still good, but it's nothing special. Okay then. So we gotta find an entrance that goes underground. And then it's gonna take us into a catacomb system where we're gonna find a bunch of shit. We actually got something over here. Look at that. Aha. Got explosive arrows, baby. Very nice. Worn leather. Upgrade items. <laughs> What's for breakfast? Oh, what did I have for breakfast today? Oh, so Cat had well, we had gone to a store called World Market uh, because we had gone there looking for like festive stuff for the winter, for like, ales and stuff for like the Christmas marathon. Cat had bought a, a few things that were like regional stuff. One of the things she got were madeleines, which I think they're like these little like little bread cakes that are sweet and they have like a citrus flavor to them. I think they're made in like either England or somewhere over in Europe. So she bought a bag of those. And she doesn't like them. She thinks they're too dry. I think they're perfect. I have an iced coffee, and I eat, like, two or three of them. And they're, like, perfect in the morning as a little, little you know, Kickstarter. That's what I had this morning. I had a two or three of those little things with iced coffee. That was my breakfast. So I was absolutely correct. Look where we are. Underground catacombs, and this is going to be where all those items are that we kept seeing. Yep. The compass holds sway over the others. His Recruitment order orders. Recruit archers in a market to the west. Worth a wizard. Hmm. Okay. Madeleines are French? Okay, I thought they were European. What's the purpose of moving that? I have no idea. Can there anything here? That's where I came in, isn't it? Yup. <laughs> What's this? Tools for a surgeon, finely crafted. Like we found in the villa. And there's a letter here, arranging payment to a blacksmith. Aha. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, how do I get this to move? There's definitely a door behind it. There we go. It's probably where I'm supposed to go to continue, so hold on. There's more stuff over here. Oh, uh, I gotta go the other way to open this from the other side. Okay. <clears throat> and that's where, yeah, I was gonna say, there's some items over there. Okay. Okay, I'm stuck. What the hell? I was stuck on the wall. That was weird. Nothing here? Nope. Okay. Barred off. Do -do 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 -do. Aha! A nice chest. How nice. I got a Brit Britain shield. Well, it's nice, but I'm not going to be equipping that because I'm using the spear right now. Whoever is having an office job. 
What I would say is the one thing I miss about having an office job was, um, how can I put it? I would put in the work and I would be able to separate that work from life. You know what I'm saying? Like right now, do I have a work-life balance? Yes, I do. I have way better work-life balance than I ever had before doing this as a job. But still, like it kind of permeates and crosses over. When I had my office job, it was like I worked my job. Yes, sometimes I had to do extra work and stay later work from home. But then I had a whole separate life outside of that office job. That office job wasn't the end all and be all of me. You know what I'm saying? Like this job, this is me. This is my hobby and my hobby is my job, which is awesome. But there really is no like separation of work and other things in life. You see what I'm saying? Messages between the leech and the compass. Healing, <clears throat> gutting. The leech is a strange one, but the compass calls to strikes. Okay. More crap. Okay, so we got our infra evidence. We can go back to Stowe I've with got enough to go on for now. Yaki and Stowe must see all this. I see more bloodshed in London's future. At least Sunin will feast. Yeah. <clears throat> well. I think we cleared everything down here. I'm looking to keep scanning, and it looks like we got all the gold. So we got all the items that were down here, at least. And this will clear up a few of the items that were showing up, you know, on the map, and it was suddenly seemed unreachable. Okay, I got them now. Nose Vacuum says, on slow nights, do I do I miss making a shit ton of money, but, but because I'm working my ass off? First of all, I'm playing video games for a living, all right? This is not hard labor, all right? And there'll be no bones about it, all right? Is, is it stressful because I have to spend a lot of time in the office? Yes. Is it stressful because I have to play a bunch of games and I have to perform, basically keep making progress in them? Yeah, you know, if I just sat here digging around, never progressed in any games, people would be pretty pissed at me. So there is some pressure to actually perform and or, you know, have some kind of uh, progress when I'm playing games, all right, immediately. Um, and I have to constantly talk to an audience like you guys. I have to constantly be able to, to communicate with you and not have any, fr you know, stage fright. There's people who, some people are just afraid of talking in front of a group of people. You have to understand, it's, I'm not talking to two people. I'm talking to hundreds of people all across the internet, all across the world right now. And some people can't handle that, all right? Luckily for me, uh, I had enough background with public speaking and other things. This is really not a big deal for me. I was able to handle it. Even the first day when I was making YouTube videos, I didn't feel nervous or nothing. Uh, I was used to, to, to doing stuff in front of an audience because of my Street Fighter days, you know? So there's things about this job that are tough, and there's things that aren't, all right? I like to think that when I'm, when I'm doing streaming, that I'm putting out a consistently good performance. You know what I mean? Like, I think consistently people are entertained by what I do. Now, admittedly, sometimes there'll be games that people don't necessarily like as much as others, and therefore they'll be a little bit disappointed if I'm playing a game they don't like. I get that. But in general, no matter what I'm playing, where you tune in, you're going to usually get a fun, honest, and entertaining experience for me. That's what I strive to do, right? So, is it disappointing that there are certain times when I'm playing, and... Well, I broke the glass, but now there's wood in the way, so that didn't really help. Is it disappointing... When I'm playing a game or something and like people don't show up or a particular stream doesn't perform as well as others. I mean, yeah, there's some disappointment there, but you have to understand, not every single stream can be a ginormous winner. And I know that, okay? I totally understand that. Not every stream is going to be, oh my God, filming a crazy amount of contributions and money tonight. You know, it's not going to happen constantly. It's just not, it wouldn't even be realistic for me to, to expect that, okay? Um, I'm happy that I can make enough to make a living, you know what I mean? And it evens out. There may be some streams that are slow. And then there's some streams that are super good. And it all evens out. And as long as it evens out, it's all good. Now, tonight, I've been streaming for almost two hours. An hour 45 minutes. I got $7 in tips. I did get a good amount of cheers tonight, by the way. I'm not complaining. But, yeah, tonight's a slow night. Am I going to sit here and complain and whine and be like, Oh, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> Find a key for the ch locked chest now. They were, everything needs a key. Well, I saw a guy who had a key on him, so I get the feeling that's the guy I need to go kill. This guy right in the middle of everybody. Anyway, getting back to the subject. Um, you know, it, not every night can be an amazingly, oh my god, everything went well night. It just can't be. It's not gonna, it's never gonna be like that, okay? The crazy amount of, the, the vest streak was, was insanely out of character for a, a streamer. To have that many incredibly successful streams 
back to back is not normal, and I know that, and I don't expect that that's going to happen moving forward at, at all. Okay, um, I'm grateful for all my contributions that do come in. You know, maybe there's some people who will contribute by the end of the stream tonight. That'd be great. If not, it's fine. It doesn't have to be every single stream. I don't. I'm not going to sit here and freak out because not every stream is insanely great. You know, I'm just not. Now, if I had a string of streams, for some reason everything's, you know, low contributions and a dry spell, yeah, then you start to have some concern. Like, what happened? Did I, did I screw up? Did I say or do something that offended people they don't want to watch me anymore? Am I, am I stale? Have I got, you know, have I have stuff gone dry because people don't find me entertaining? You know, there's got to be a reason for that kind of stuff. You know what I mean? Um, <clears throat> luckily, that hasn't happened in a very long time for me. Things usually say consistently good for me. And I'm very grateful for that, by the way. Yeah, bring some wool over there. I'm pulling the wrong guy. I love that he's targeting the wrong guy. I got him. I stunned him by hitting his weak point. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Whoa, that was the first time I've seen that one. The levels that I got in, in freaking... Asgard are definitely paying off here. Like, I am kicking major ass right now. These guys can't do shit to me. Like, I'm way more powerful than that. I'm just turboing through this. It didn't used to be this easy. Like, not this many enemies anyway. Like, yeah, I was killing the enemies fairly consistently, but not this easily, you know? Well, here's the key, and that's what I wanted. Okay. I have a few shout outs to do here. From the chest. A blacksmith's hammer? That's a weapon. Oh. I wonder if that's any good. I haven't gotten a hammer style uh, weapon yet, right? Let's take a look. Blacksmith hammer, superior hammer, power of 100. Oh, wait, it's not power of 100. I'm stupid. It's a 68, but I can upgrade it. Can't upgrade it further. Darn. Right now it's only 74. But it has high stun rate. Yeah, it seems like it has a high stun rate. And I could put runes in it, too. Block bonus, poison buildup, fire buildup. I got some pretty decent runes. I just, I love the spear. The spear is so good. Okay, so I got a bunch of contributions during this segment. Mandalorian Merc tipped me $3.50. Thank you to Mandalorian Merc for that tip. I appreciate that. Um, Peter Heydrick, Chase, I'm, I'm glad Disney allowed Assassin's Creed used the Thor franchise for this game. They did not. It's silly. It's, it's real lore from the Vikings. This head's not owned by Marvel. Um... Then he chooses what's the what's the vest streak? You'll want to talk to the people in the stream chat about that. They'll give you a more more elaboration. Uh, an anonymous dollar tipper says, Am I gonna do any overtime tonight? Uh it depends. I actually have to use the bathroom and I'm out of water right now. I drank it all. So I'm thinking I'm gonna go like another few minutes, maybe take a quick break, and maybe I'll I will do another hour. I'm not sure. An anonymous sub gifter gifted a sub to a silent weapons the third or silent weapons three. Congratulations, silent weapons. Okay. Um Maybe I'll switch it up. What if I do, like... What the fuck? What if I do Thor's hammer or whatever, and I do... 
This new shield. The Britain's shield. Consider a superior light shield, and I can upgrade that. And that has a rune, rune slot? Yes. Obviously, I'm going to do block. Why wouldn't I do extra block? So maybe I'll try Thor's hammer. I haven't had a hammer yet, so maybe I'll give it a shot. I need more equi or more stuff to upgrade it. Runes. This is in the house crawl's axe. Poison build up, fire build up. I'm try it fire build up. See if we can, maybe maybe it causes fire or something. No, give it a shot. Something different. Might as well. I got a new axe. I'll try. Look at it. It's, it's freaking hammer. A giant blacksmith hammer. Pretty cool. All right. So we got some majorly sidetracked. Obviously, we don't have to kill all these guys. All I gotta do is go back here. I want. I wanted to get the hammer. Is what it is. So. Alright, let's sneak out. <laughs> I snuck in, killed a bunch of them, stole the hammer, and now we'll sneak out. Admittedly, now that I can carry more arrows, and my arrows do increased damage with every hit, these arrows are way more effective. So, learning, you know, what's good and what's not, and these arrows seem crazy good. Look how many enemies were there looking for me. I snuck in, stole their hammer, it's funny. I steal a fucking hammer. <laughs> Did I hear about a $600 stimulus check? I heard that that's what's being talked about in, in our government right now. That they're, 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 uh, the next check might be 600 bucks, and we may or may not get it. They're still arguing about it. I mean, they're hilariously bad. Other governments have been giving money all along, right? Isn't it true that Canada, the, is it the UK, and many other countries, they've been giving their citizens money during the entire COVID thing? We got one $1,200 check. That was it. No <laughs> Citizens got nothing else in the country. And by the way, you had to qualify for that check. Some people didn't. A lot of people did, but that's it. They think that $1,200 was somehow supposed to make up for the fact that people lost their jobs, people had insane amounts of decreased income or had increased expenses because of COVID. They're out of their minds, right? You, you didn't get anything? UK got nothing? Okay, so UK's the same as us then. <laughs> UK got fucked, just like us. Yes, and we pay for healthcare, that's correct. So we're all paying for our own health insurance and shit. And then they gave us a one twelve hundred dollar check all year and said, "Oh, here's for COVID. Hope this took care of you." Gee, thanks. <laughs> it's worth knocking on a few doors. That's all I'm saying. Trigger wasn't killed because you want to plant a few trees and fix a few roofs in London. Looks less like a meal for crows in here. Hey, boy, you bring good findings, I hope. A few sheets of vellum. Notes between members of a secret society. The Order of the Ancients, they are called. Order of the Ancients? Doesn't sound That's any it. bells in this head. What's the purpose? They're a bunch of assholes. That would take some time to explain. <laughs> but know this, that I am here to kill them. Yeah, we're rooting for the assassins, and the assassins the introduced us to this. The head, the arrow, and the leech are his hands. Okay. Pet names and secret orders. What a crock. We know anything we can act on. So it sounds to me like these three are all in the order, and this is going to lead us into getting information about the other targets in the order that we can kill, which is one of the missions we're supposed to be doing overall in the story of the game. So, okay. The arrow is a Dane who has seen his share of battle. His name suggests he is an archer. I bet my knuckles he's the one sowing discord among the Danes that shelter in London. If it were me, I'd hide among my ranks, surrounded by other fighting men. The arrow has orders from the compass. To recruit soldiers at a market in the west. I know the very place. Okay. The leech buys thralls? The leech has need of flesh. Been looking for thralls. Though I cannot say why. We found a number of dead down by the keys lately. But not thralls alone. Some of the missing we find again. In several places. Cut to pieces. Good mm. lord, Ed. Yuck. Okay, and then we got the compass leads them. He's the leader. The compass is a mystery. He is mentioned often, but there is little to go on. Said he was a Frankish captain, did you? To find him, we'd have to mark the ships that came and went along the Thames. Captains are a transient sort. It may be he's far away, keeping quiet. That may be, but would he scream if we cut off his hands? Oh, you've a filthy mind for strategy. Mm. Kill the arrow and the leech, then sit back and wait. Let the compass come to us. 
Okay. So we got three targets and they're all order members. Let us not waste cool. any more time. We'll find the arrow and the leech. Killing both should drag the compass back into port. So, I will catch you at the Western Market. Count on it. And I'll make for the keys. There's another few bodies there to fish out of the muck. It could be the leech is back at work. God be with us, friends. Go in his name and be protected by him. All right. We're probably at three, or two targets because they're not going to let us get the compass yet. We got to kill the other two first, I believe, right? So. <clears throat> yeah, see, multiple quests accepted. Oh, let's take a look at the quests and see where they are. Uh, quests. So, firing the arrow or bleeding the leech. I guess we'll fire the arrow first. All right, this is just right across town. This one we still can't do because the guy's not home. So right across town. Yep. Okay. Let's actually save. I've been playing for two hours now. Let's save up. Like I said, I'll take that quick break because I gotta, I gotta use the bathroom anyway. And uh, we'll go from there. Cool.